The People's Republic of China's military aerospace sector has established a pattern of achieving technological milestones, but then keeping completely silent about those advancements during the kind of major international expositions when a newsworthy development is normally announced with great fanfare. This isn't just for Western conferences. In the years when it was still safe for Western defense correspondents to freely attend the PRC's largest defense expo, Airshow China, the joke was always that there would be a game of hide-and-seek about news that would only come out after the show. China's J-20 stealth fighter, a short explainer. The Chengdu J-20 Mighty Dragon Jet represents a major breakthrough for Chinese military development. This stealthy twin-engine fighter aircraft is only the fourth, fifth-generation fighter in the world, with capabilities making it at the very least a near-peer to America's F-22 and F-35, as well as Russia's Su-57. The Chinese military began to deploy the J-20 in hotly contested regions in the East and South China Seas in April, indicating its confidence in the full operational capabilities of the jet. The stealth technology behind the Mighty Dragon appears to rival the U.S. fifth-generation fighter jets. Its fuselage shape, engine intake shape, exhaust nozzle shape, and even the paint design mirror, the F-22 and F-35. Before the J-20, China primarily used Russian parts and designs to construct its military equipment. Initially, the Chinese military relied on Russian-made engine systems for the new jet, but it eventually nixed these and produced its own engines, the WS-15. This marked a major improvement for China's aircraft development capabilities, as the J-20 is truly a homegrown technology. While some speculate the J-20 is faster than the F-22, it is unclear whether or not the jet has its supercruise capabilities. However, the U.S. is confident the J-20 is capable of beyond visual range, BVR engagements, meaning they could lock on to an enemy aircraft, launch a missile 100 miles away, and then leave the airspace instead of dogfighting. It is clear the J-20 represents major advancements for the Chinese military, yet significant drawbacks do exist. The engine systems that power the jets remain the most controversial aspect of the aircraft. The People's Liberation Army initially used Russian engines, but switched to domestic production once they were underperforming. It is unclear whether this production is on schedule or how efficiently they run. According to an analyst from the Yuan Wang military think tank in Beijing, the American XA-100 engine that powers the F-35 remains at least 10 years ahead of the WS-15. The analyst elaborated that China has so far just matched the American engines in some areas, but not in overall performance. It's also not meaningful to emphasize one area because military confrontation is about a competition of systems and a contest of joint operational capabilities. Overall, the J-20 is a capable fifth-generation multi-role aircraft challenging the best the U.S. has to offer. While its full potential is as yet unknown, it remains a major threat to U.S. designs in the Western Pacific. Furthermore, it is solid proof of a competent and growing domestic Chinese aerospace defense industry that will no doubt rival the West in the near future.